a fan of the Just Cause series, Just Cause 1, especially Just Cause 2, because that one was fucking amazing. Show of hands, uh huh, high five, no, anybody want to do some Guinea Force stances and shit? Maybe we can do like, hi, hi, ah, whatever, it doesn't matter. Just Cause 3 is coming up. To much ovation and much celebration on the part of fans because, well, I, I personally didn't think that was going to end up happening, but when I got to see that trailer for it, it was like, yes, I can't fucking wait until that shit comes up. They announced that they were going to be doing some kind of crazy-ass giveaway, something to likes that you've never seen before, especially when it comes to gaming. They're giving away an island. Now, initially, I thought, okay, so what, it, is somebody going to have an island in the game, just like their own shit within the video game universe, only they get, nope, an actual island. So I, I kept on thinking, okay, this is sketchy. There's no fucking way that you have an island to just go and give out all willy-nilly. Just like, here you go, just go and take that. Somewhere that's in the tropical islands and it's an absolute dream. Something that's gonna be the most amazing shit that you've ever seen before. You know, something that you want to vacation to. Something that's isolated from all of civilization, but is still a retreat for anybody trying to go and get away from the hustle and bustle of everyday normal life within the populated regions of the city. Something that everybody would love to have. You know, an actual dream. Except for they said that it's going to be a $50,000 island. Let me go and make this perfectly clear. If you think right now that you can get a good, worthwhile island for a cool fifty fucking thousand dollars I'm going to be the bearer of bad news and start dropping truth bombs everywhere. You are going to get this, you're going to get something the size of a broom closet. And it's probably going to be in the middle of an area that's still suffering from radiation. This shit's going to be bad. It's going to be about the size of a janitorial broom closet. I'm talking, you can go onto one side of the island, I can go to the other, I can rip ass, and you can smell it on the opposite side of the island. This shit won't be big, and it won't be all that great. It probably won't even be habitable by normal humans, or anything living for that matter. You know, this is going to fucking suck shit through a straw, a twirly straw. That's all I'm saying. Now, I could be completely wrong. They, they could have something that's amazing, but let's also keep something in mind. You know what else comes with getting one of these islands? You are going to be paying taxes through the fucking nose. You're gonna have to pay for so many things just to own and maintain and be allowed to have that piece of land. So let's just go and toss that out there. This shit ain't technically going to be free. You're like, yeah, I won this. And, and oh, you know, I should explain. How do you go about winning such a thing? Is it just merely buying Just Cause 3? No. See, you have to go and rack up a whole bunch of chaos points. And you end up getting that from causing what? Chaos! Chaos! Skylanders, fuck it, why not? So you're going to have to go and rack up all these chaos points. And the first thing that came to mind is this being released on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. I'm going to have to lean towards the PC market that this game's going to be cracked the fuck open and broken and somebody's going to max out the amount of chaos points that they can get to the point that it's glitching. Then they show up in the top bracket, the top 10, they show up at the very, very tippy top and then they win that island, which essentially is going to be like, hey, you just won cancer. <laughs> what? Have fun. <laughs> like. What, what the fuck? Like, yeah. So you'll be getting island cancer. Small ass, uninhabitable island cancer. Oh fucking joy of joy. This isn't some Gilligan Island retreat. There ain't gonna be no fucking Marianne on there. There ain't gonna be no fucking Ginger. You know what there's gonna be? You sitting there suffering from fucking swamp ass on something that's the size of a gnat's dick floating in water. So, yeah, you can go and tap dance on that for a little while. And I, you know, everybody will be like, oh man, you're such a pessimist and you're so negative about it. Motherfucker, at least I read the fine print of shit. And at least I look at this realistically. You know, if you're gonna win something, at least make it good, right? M remember that whole fucking, that zombie shelter that you could get? You know, that, that was kind of cool. I was just like, there was some badass stuff with that, because they'll go and deliver and set it up and all that shit. But this is silly. This can't really work all that well. I don't know where the fucking island's gonna be at. You know, are, are we talking about like a fucking delta or some shit so we can have a pretend island that's in the middle of some fucking rank-ass city that's just got a little fucking river crossing through it? 
Just pulling out some shit now. Just pulling out some shit. Who the fuck knows? It, and, you know, Square Enix gets to choose this location. Do you really think that they're gonna buckle down and be paying through the fucking nose so that you can have your little island retreat? Fuck and no. So, just, <laughs> let's go with that. So, Just Cause 3 is going to be amazing. It, it, the game's gonna be fun as hell, there's gonna be carnage to cause everywhere, and it's just gonna be a fantastic little adventure where you get to have a little sandbox game on one gigantic fucking night. Just Cause 2 was a huge ass game, this one's gonna be bigger. So I can't wait to go and see the stuff that they have included with this kind of weaponry. I, I just, I, I want that little fucking slingshot thingy, the one that, you know, you can pull yourself all over the place, kind of like Bionic Commando, but on fucking like super roids and shit. I can't wait to see what they do with that in a game like this. I've seen some of the vehicles flying around just you know it's just cause if you've ever played one of the games you know some of the insane shit that you can do with that most people think of like the crazy shit in Grand Theft Auto no just cause fuck yeah I can't wait for it but the wind and island thing no nah, this shit's this shit's gonna be fucking lame trust me on that anyway this is Alpha Omega Sin as always nerds nerdettes and gamers game the fuck on <laughs>